Um, hi. Um, hello. Welcome back. I am doing a review of Prototype 2 for the Xbox 360. Um, in general, it's an open world superhero game where you stop Blackwatch and the game's antagonist Alex Mercer from destroying New York City from the inside out, and you have to stop them. And you have the same virus that Alex Mercer has. But you use it for good. And to, to save New York. And um, the power I just used was Blade. It can like cut people in half. Um, like you can do a bio bonds, but when you sneak up on enemies, you earn that later in the game. Um... I say that be warned there it could be like a lot of language in it if you want like go through with the whole story but um you would have to be careful if you're like young so be careful with that because this game this game is fun overall it just has like a lot of violence and language in it um so it's suited for people around adults adult age so be careful about that. Keep in mind. Um, this game, like I say, this game was, is really fun to play. I would recommend to anyone who played the first one and thought it wasn't very good. But th this one is even better, in my, in everyone's opinion. I read other reviews of this on gaming websites, and they said that this game is a lot better. So, I would recommend this to people who like uh, superhero games or open world. I recommend that you buy this game. Um, I just got it like a couple weeks ago and, I'm, and I was impressed by how good that this game was. And, um, well, I wanted it when it first came out, so... I had to wait like two months, but oh well. So this game's been out for two months. It came out April 24th, made it by Activision and Radical Design. This is gameplay. Um, these are the powers you can have. You will unlock them all by, by the time you beat the final boss. But as you consume more enemies, like specifically, who have like a booster thing uh, icon on their head, like once you defeat them and consume them, your powers are upgrade. And once you complete Black Knight missions, um, you unlock new mutations, which further increase your powers. Depending on like power um, boost or defensive or predator offensive, uh, that kind of stuff. Um, so overall, it, it like. There's some false spots. The action can get repetitive if, like, you're always in alert by Blackwatch or the military. It, yeah. Anyways, you could change um, your appearance to fool Blackwatch into thinking that you're one of them. And you can infiltrate their base, which you have to during missions throughout the story. So, um, this your usual design. And and this is your disguise. Once you consume this guy, um, you can interact with the commander of the Black Watch forces in New York. So, like, he'll give you information for upcoming missions that de develop later into the story. There's three zones: green zone, yellow zone, and red zone. What I'm in right now is the yellow zone. Uh, there's also another company called Gentech, which is like it was almost designed. The black light virus was designed by Gentech, and the red zone, huh, phew, it's a the really most dangerous one. So overall, it's a great game. Go check it out if you if you want. All right, I'll talk to. You. Uh, hopefully, I can make make another video soon. So talk to you guys later. All right, bye.